face masks. I don't like it. I let Good morning, everybody. It is the 20th of April. Happy 420 to those of you who celebrated. It is 10 a.m. and I'm just waiting for my friends to get in the car because we're going to the groceries. I know I said I was going to do it yesterday, but uh, my friend didn't wake up, so we were like, okay, we have to go tomorrow because we're both going to run out of food. So we are headed to the grocery now, and yeah, I hope there's not a lot of people because before we would go at like 9 a.m. and the lines would be so long. Fingers crossed it's not as long today, but... Who knows? <laughs> Update, it is about 2.40. Um, I left my friend at the grocery, but it wasn't an accident. I just, it was a plan. I mean, it wasn't a plan. It was just more of, because uh, my friend and I, obviously we have separate carts and I normally use a smaller cart and they normally use the big ones. And so that means we have to line up at separate counters, cashiers, tills, <laughs> and um, my uh, cashier is much faster because, like I said, I use a smaller cart, so generally um, people blaze through that cashier pretty quickly. However, the big carts take a really long time, and I was texting my friend while they were in line, and I was like, I have ice cream, I think it's going to melt. And then my friend was like, oh no, what are you going to do about that? Because I didn't bring my cooler this time, last time I brought my cooler, so I was able to keep my ice cream cold. <laughs> But um, I was like, you know what? I can make it home and back here in like 20 minutes. So that's what I did. Um, I went home, dropped off all my like fresh produce. I still have like canned goods and like instant noodles here in the car. But all the fresh produce, all the things that need to be put in the fridge, I've dropped it off at home, put it in the fridge. So now I'm just waiting for my friend to come out of the grocery. I'm actually nowhere near the grocery because they still have like quite a wait before they're actually in line uh, before they're actually at the till so just parked on the side of the road eating um melon <laughs> i bought this at the grocery because i was getting hungry as i was shopping and i saw like melons and i was like you know i'm gonna buy this so i can eat while i'm in line but i completely forgot about it until i unpacked all my fresh produce i was like oh, yeah i bought melons and i'm just gonna eat it in the car because i'm starving it's as much as I love trips to the grocery because it means I get to go out, I hate it because it takes so long to get in. It takes so long to get out. So, <sighs> I'm hungry. I'll probably update you guys when I'm back home cooking lunch, I guess. <laughs> I've been home for about an hour now. Time check. It is 4.30. Um, I've just been putting away my groceries, making sure everything... Um, has a place. <laughs> um, I'm really proud of how well I've tidied up my groceries, both in my cupboard and in the fridge, but then I look at the rest of the house and it's just, mm -mm. <laughs> I will tidy up the house maybe tomorrow. I mean, after all, I have all the time in the world. Like I said, I won't really be working out for a while, mainly because of my rash. I'm gonna wait until my rash, I don't know what it is. I'm gonna wait until it gets better because it is kind of hard to move when I feel the pain, especially because it's like right above my left leg. So, well, not right above, just, yeah, generally above my left leg. So it hurts when I walk. It's like, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> um, And even my friend was like, maybe it'll get agitated if you sweat. So as much as I want to work out, because I'm looking at my body right now and I'm not that happy about it, <laughs> um, I need to get better first. And it is looking better, but it's still painful and <laughs> Anyway. For lunch today, I'm going to be trying these Indomie salted egg flavored noodles. Here's the thing, Indomie in Hong Kong, we call it lo mein, garlic noodles, and it's like 7-Eleven food, and it's the best thing ever, like, it is my childhood. <laughs> um, so I love mee goreng in general, but I saw this flavor in the grocery, and I was like, hello. I'm gonna try today, just out of pure curiosity. And then I'm just going to chill around for the rest of the day. I mean, there's not much to do. I know I could be cleaning up the house, but mm, not in the mood. It smells so good. It smells like Frankie's salted egg chicken wings, which are my favorite, so. Mm. Oh, that's good. 
Finished eating the noodles, devoured it in practically 10 minutes. I've washed my dish, dish, pot, <laughs> and um, washed my hands and everything. And I got out a little Kinder Egg. And the reason why I bought this, I actually bought two, but one's still in the fridge. And I don't think I'm going to eat two in one day. I bought this because I didn't get any chocolate eggs last Sunday. Um, I don't know. I just, I really wanted to have a chocolate egg, at least in a way I could have still been festive, but I wasn't able to go out last Sunday, so I'm getting a chocolate egg today, one week later. I miss it when Kinder Eggs used to be actual eggs, like a chocolate egg and there was something inside. Now it's, I forgot how sweet this was. Mm. Yeah, I am for sure not having two in one day. Wow, that's so sweet. Okay, so we put this here. Oh, it doesn't have like a satisfying clicking sound. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> See, this why it needs a satisfying clicking sound. I don't want falling apart. What? We've clicked on this bracelet lasso thing. Oh yeah, eee. Time check, it is 7.15 and honestly, because I woke up early to go to the grocery today, I want to pass out. And that has been a thought on my mind since about 5 p.m. <laughs> Basically, when after I was done eating, I really just wanted to go to sleep because I feel so tired. But obviously it's so early and that's just going to mess up my body clock more messed up than it already is. So I've just been taking my online course on Dutch. Because the dress is a het word. And it is onze universiteit. Because universiteit is a de word. For plural possessions, oh. we always use onze. Time check. It is 9.05. I managed to make it through y'all. I didn't fall asleep on the floor. <laughs> So, actually, I'm gonna start editing this vlog just so I can stay awake for a little bit longer. And then when I'm done with that, I'm gonna take a shower and then I'm gonna hop into bed. <laughs> so, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hello, everybody. It is the 21st of April. It is about 3.30. Um, I got out of bed around 1, 2, I don't remember. But um, last night did not go as well as I thought it would. I did not fall asleep as quickly as I thought I would. And I think it's because I was so tired that I was getting anxious. Like, because I would close my eyes and I would very slowly drift off. But then I would, like, jolt awake. I don't know why. But um, it took a while before I actually fell asleep. And when I did fall asleep, um, I would wake up every now and then because my dreams were really weird. Not bad but weird. I mean, there were a few bad ones, but mostly weird and uncomfortable dreams. So I would wake up like nanny. <laughs> like I would wake up a lot. And so long story short, my sleep did not go as well as I originally thought it would. So today I have to work out, like regardless of my rash. And the main reason why I haven't been working out is because my rash has been really painful. And my fear is that if sweat gets on it, it's going to get really agitated and it's just going to get worse. But today, it, it's looking a little better. It still hurts. It feels like a bruise, honestly, but it's not as red as it used to be. Not as itchy as it used to be either. So I'm going to work out today, but I'm just going to make sure that not much sweat gets on it. And I'm not going to use my waist trimmer. Actually, that might be the reason why I have a rash. It might be the waist trimmer. Hmm. I actually decided that I wanted to have some hard-boiled eggs as well. So I'm just boiling some water and once that gets to like a rolling boil, I'm going to put in the eggs and then cook it for 10 minutes and then put it in an ice bath and then peel them and then I can eat. <laughs> just listen for five seconds. Oh. I don't need to eat a Time check. It's nearly... Oh. <laughs> Sorry. My phone might go off every, mm, every now and then because there is a rally on Twitter about Benilde which is my alma mater. And um, I had a few things to say. So um, that might happen, but let's try to ignore it. I think the last clip I filmed was, was of my food a while ago. And since then, I've just been chilling. I have 
accomplished nothing. <laughs> However, I did receive my face masks in the mail. In the mail. I had it delivered. So it didn't quite go in the mail. But I received them. And I'm so happy about these because these are waterproof. There is a filter in them. And um, they are washable. So uh, I personally use uh, disposable face masks, but I've run out. And if you watched my vlog, I think two weeks ago, uh, N95 masks really hurt my face. So I found these online and I decided to purchase them. And I think they're great. I bought pink ones for myself, black ones for my friend. I do have to wash those first before I, um, one, give them to my friend, or two, actually start using them, because it said I have to wash them first. So I'm going to do that maybe later on. But right now, I'm going to tidy up the plates I used to eat. Yes, I know I ate five hours ago, but the plates are still there. <laughs> so I decided not to work out today because I realized, like I said, I have to film a video, and I just don't have the time to work out. Um, and this is okay with me simply because uh, I ate less than 1,200 calories anyway, so I can go a day without working out. However, I will work out tomorrow for sure. I just need to get this video done. I'm going to film it and then edit it and then go straight to bed. Fingers crossed. Oh wait, no. I'll shower first. <laughs> Hello everybody. It is the 22nd of April. It is nearly 4 p.m. I got out of bed around 2 and I think I went to sleep around 7. I couldn't sleep, <laughs> but um, I've just been fixing up the final details on the video that's going up today, which is um, taking care of my mental health in quarantine. That was kind of hard for me to film because like, I'm not that good at taking care of my mental health. <laughs> but yeah, so that video's up and ready to go. It'll be out at 9.30 like my videos are supposed to be. Sometimes it doesn't make it to 9.30 because my internet does not want to cooperate. But uh, I've just been eating a pear, a really cold one, just how I like it, because I keep my pears in the fridge. Oh, it's so good. I miss eating pears. I haven't eaten a pear in a while. I tried to work out earlier, but my rash is not having it. It is getting better, though. It's just, it's such a, it kind of feels like one big bruise at this point. So moving is a big no-no. Um, as I'm eating this pear, I'm just trying to figure out what I'm going to eat today. I'm thinking if I should go for kimchi fried rice or noodles. I don't really know. I'll figure it out, but yeah. So I just finished eating. It's almost 7 p.m. I made kimchi fried rice. It had beef and spam, which if you know me well enough, I don't really like spam. Not because I don't like the taste, but because of the amount of calories in one can. So I cooked about half a can of spam for the fried rice. It had onions and mushrooms and corn. What else did it have? It had a lot of things. I was just like adding so many things until it, it was too late when I realized I may have put too many things, but it tasted really nice. So that's done. I also cleaned up and put away my leftovers. Now I'm just gonna have Melona. I'm just gonna have some ice cream because it's so hot today. I don't know what the issue is. It's already nighttime, so it's not as hot as it was a while ago. But man, like, I could just be standing and I'd be sweating. I'm not okay with it. So I have to have the fan on. But yeah, I'm just gonna chill for the rest of the night. I'm probably gonna take my online course um, on Dutch. And yeah, hello everybody. It is the 23rd of April. It's like 6.30, nearly 6.30. I just finished working out, finally. <laughs> I found the strength to work out. Um, I'm just taking it easy today. I say easy, it is. <laughs> So difficult to work out after I've been practically idle for an entire week. Uh, I focused more on dancing, more on just cardio, trying to get used to moving more. And then I did 10 minute abs, just finished, dead. <laughs> but I'm um, really happy that I'm able to work out. My rash slash bruise slash wound does not hurt when I move anymore. It does still sting every now and then, but it doesn't hurt when I move so taking advantage of that dancing working out I'm so tired taking my time I haven't really been pushing myself too hard because um, I know that I might not be able to take it but I am pushing myself enough to where I'm sweating and I know that I'm actually 
working my muscles and using it. I have an intense craving for a hot pot today. I mean, I always do. <laughs> so I'm gonna make kimchi jjigae. Um, the lobster balls, fish balls, and crab steaks. I didn't manage to buy um, fish cakes. They're all just defrosting. And then I'm gonna put more vegetables than meat, which I'm proud of. So there's gonna be bell peppers. I might put onions. I have tofu, thank God, tofu, thank God. Um, mushrooms, bean sprouts. And yeah, I'm just gonna rest for a bit, drink some water, <laughs> catch my breath. And then, yeah. I finally have tofu and I actually put some bean sprouts on top of the ramen. So it kind of looks healthy, but it's really not. I put some leftover Spam from yesterday in because I don't cook the whole tin of Spam because of the calories. There's fish balls and there's actually crab sticks under the tofu. I just didn't want to put the tofu too deep into the soup because it might disintegrate. <laughs> there's kimchi, bell peppers, and gnocchi mushrooms. And I put a crap ton of bird's eye chili. So this is going to be super spicy and I'm so excited. My wife, when she's done, she's gonna be down with just one rib left. Say hi, Mahal. Hi, Mahal. Hi, hi. <laughs> hi, hi. I'm in the butcher right now, but hi, what's up? <laughs> It is 4 30. Uh, I just finished working out. Super tired. I'm not as sweaty as I was a while ago because I'm sitting right in front of the fan, so my sweat is drying up pretty quickly. I'm feeling kind of lazy today. I don't have the energy to cook, so I'm gonna go downstairs and buy myself some sweaty for chicken. Um, but besides that, my agenda for today is to clean up the house. I really want to clean the bathroom. Um, everything else is generally clean. I think it's more of I just want to tidy the house and I'm gonna change my sheets which honestly I'm not excited about because my mattress is so heavy so changing the sheets is an absolute chore but I'm gonna do it so that I could take it to the laundry tomorrow and yeah I'm super tired I'm out of breath because I've just been dancing for about 20 minutes I'm so tired but um, yeah I'm gonna go downstairs buy some food and then come back home eat and then rest for a bit and then clean I am back home now and that was one heck of a workout because um, it was so hot. So that was the first thing, it was so hot and I had to walk to the further branch because the branch near to where I live was, it was open but only um, delivery riders are allowed to go in. So I was going to have it delivered but then I, I saw on the app like the amount of extra you have to pay in order to have it delivered and I was like, okay, I do not have enough cash on hand for that. So I walked to the further branch in the heat. <laughs> I'm sweating so bad, but um, I don't mind. It's a bit of extra exercise and fresh air that isn't from my apartment. So <laughs> I'm going to eat now. It smells so good. <laughs> And uh, yeah, hello everybody. It is the 25th of April. It's about 3.15 and I just got out of bed. Um, I stayed up all night. Well, not all night. Uh, I spent the entire night cleaning the flat and because I washed my hair and I don't like using heat in my hair, I stayed up just waiting for it to air dry. So I need to catch up on some sleep. The house is clean. I'm very proud of it. I didn't vlog anything, obviously, because... There's nothing interesting about cleaning the house. Plus, I was sweating so hard, like little dripping sweat, and I didn't think that was very nice. <laughs> so I cleaned the bathroom, cleaned the living room, tidied up some of my stuff, changed my sheets, which honestly, I, I hate it. I hate it. I mean, I mean, they're nice, but the green ones were more soothing to look at. So, I don't know. I don't like it. I don't. I don't like it. <laughs> I miss my green sheets already. 
Um, I'm probably going to change it back to the green ones the moment I get it back from the laundry. Because <laughs> I don't, I, I mean, it, I'm not saying it looks bad. I just, I personally don't like it. I, what? <laughs> so my agenda for today is I'm just going to eat, going to eat my leftovers from yesterday. Um, maybe a bit of rice. And then after eating, I'm going to go take my stuff to the laundry. And then, when I come home, I'm just going to rest for a bit, because obviously I had just eaten. And then I'm going to work out. And then I'm probably going to watch Love Never Dies on YouTube. And obviously, I'm going to have to edit this vlog basis going up tomorrow. So that means I'm going to end this vlog here. I know I've been ending my Saturdays a little shorter than usual. Um, and this is because... My vlogs take so, so long to upload that I have to end it as early as possible so that I could upload it as early as possible so it gets up on time. So I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you so much for choosing to watch my video. If you haven't already, please just subscribe. It really, really would mean the world to me. And I hope to see you back here next week. Bye.